we would find pornographic pictures of sexual acts. And it was all open and obvious. It doesn't take much common sense to figure out what the deal really is. That number is just the tip of the iceberg. It is a crime that happens against children in every neighborhood, in every city and state in the country. I think I was like anybody else that hears about it for the first time. There's that disbelief. There's no possible way this is true because this is the United States. It's an incredibly profitable, as horrifying as it is to say, business. Here are the economics. You're a drug trafficker, you can sell drugs once. You're a human trafficker, you can sell a kid over and over and over again. A lot of the data on underage trafficking is very difficult, and there's numbers all over the place. We think it's around the 100,000 mark. 12 to 15 percent of the kids we serve were victims of human trafficking. There are estimates out there that 1.6 million homeless kids are out on the street at any given time. You could be talking about 100, 150,000 kids who have been victims of human trafficking. Our kids are not visible. The number could be even higher. These children who are once visible on street corners are now quickly, efficiently, and anonymously sold online. Wherever you look, however you slice it, the numbers are huge and the demand is huge. The majority of children that we see trafficked online have been trafficked on Backpage.